given to us is a quadrant and a rectangle with same height as of quadrant the length of red line segment which is a chord in the quadrant is 8 cm with this limited data we have to find the area of rectangle and that to in 10 seconds let's check the solution we'll solve the same question by two ways our first approach will be formal approach and the second approach will be the logical where we'll learn to solve it in 10 seconds let's check the first approach from center o let's draw a perpendicular on chord ae the perpendicular from the center bisects the chord thus af and fe are equal from point e let's draw a perpendicular on ad now let's name this angle as alpha so this angle here will be 90 minus alpha and the remaining angle here will be alpha degrees the triangle afo and triangle ega these are similar by angle angle similarity as the triangles are similar thus the ratio of corresponding sides will be equal or af upon ao will be equal to eg upon ea putting the values here we have got af is 4 cm and ea is 8 cm now here if we'll see ao ao is the radius of the quadrant so ao is equals to om also this om that is equals to the length of the rectangle that is bc and also here eg eg length is same as ab here now cross multiplying it we'll get ab times bc is 4 times 8 but ab times bc that is your length times breadth of the rectangle or area of rectangle the area of rectangle is 32 cm square and that's our answer now let's check the second approach in this logical approach we'll exploit the fact that area of rectangle is dependent only on the length of this chord which is 8 cm so as long as this length of the chord is maintained as 8 then the area of rectangle will remain fixed irrespective of the radius of the quadrant So in this second figure, now here if we'll see the radius of quadrant is smaller, the rectangle is little broader, but as long as we are maintaining this length of chord as 8 cm, we are fulfilling all the conditions of the question, and thus area of rectangle will remain same. Otherwise, the question will become invalid. Let's reduce the size of this quadrant slightly more, such that the chord length will remain same, but this end of the chord. will lie on the opposite end of the quadrant so in this new figure still all the original conditions of the question are met and thus the area of rectangle should remain same now here we can solve this triangle to find the radius of the quadrant using pythagoras theorem so the radius is 4 root 2 cm and this rectangle is now in form of a square whose area is 4 root 2 square or 32 cm square and that's our answer i hope you enjoyed the solution i will see you in next video till then tata bye bye